San Francisco right now. My friend, I was just taking a picture of that. So, I was just taking a picture moment. of that sign, sorry. This is a good moment probably to get started. So can I have everybody's oh, attention? I'm sorry. So, my name is Tommy Albacoli Mecca. I'm with the Housing Rights Committee. Housing Rights Committee. And um, we are here today because there's an epidemic of evictions happening in San Francisco. An epidemic of evictions, as you can see from the number of tenants standing in front of the Christmas tree. They're mostly Ellis Act evictions, but some are owner move-in. The evictions are motivated by greed. Landlord and speculators wanting to make a ton of dough selling units as tenancies in common, TICs. In fact, we are here today in the Castro because the supervisor of the Castro district has... Boo! Boo! Down with Boo! Boo! How do you really feel about him? has introduced legislation to allow up to 2,000 TICs to bypass our lottery process and condo convert. That means, that means more evictions, folks. That means more incentive for landlords and speculators to evict more tenants like these folks. Okay? That's our message to Scott Wiener, is this is what happens when you allow them to condo convert. Scott Wiener doesn't govern. Right now, we have been able to track 26 buildings, John, can you step aside for a moment? 26 buildings here that are being Ellis acted. 26 buildings. And this is a very partial list. These are the buildings representing tenants that have come into one of our offices for counseling. It is by no means a complete list. But if you notice, there are 17 buildings in the mission. In the mission. How do you spell gentrification and displacement? Scott Wiener. Thank you. The tenants in these buildings are long-term tenants. They're long-term rent control tenants. They're mostly seniors, people with AIDS, immigrants, disabled persons, families with children, people with nowhere to go in this immorally high rental market. We are now the highest rental market in the country. We call, we call on supervisors to reject Scott Wiener's TIC legislation. We call on our state officials to repeal the Ellis Act. That's right. yeah. 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 And we call on our local officials, including the mayor, to work with our state officials to repeal the Ellis Act. That's what we want. In short, we want this epidemic. We want this epidemic of evictions treated as a health crisis, because it is. It's a health emergency. Because, let me tell you, seniors, people with AIDS, immigrants, vulnerable people, do not fare well when they are evicted. It affects their health. It is a health crisis. So let's send back a message to everybody in this city. Happy holidays. We're not going away. We're staying to fight for our homes to fight for our neighborhoods, to fight for our city. Yeah.